Hi guys, welcome back. Right, I've just played this game on the rank queue. Doing my little poles build again. Uh, but I think I've refined it so it's okay. Um, and I had this massive, massive thanks DE moment. It was either thanks DE or there's some, some sort of crash that or cheat that causes your opponent to crash. I don't know. I'm assuming it's just a thanks DE moment. But... Um, Let's just say this game went pretty well. I pretty much won. And then the game crashed. Just, well, you'll see how it goes later. But um, yeah, we're doing the, the poles sort of uh, fast castle into knights with a castle drop. Now, the main point of this is not to really cause too much damage with your knights. It's all about uh, trying to just survive, <laughs> kill off the enemy's units if you can. Uh, but the big the big thing is the castle drop, which should happen at around 18 and a half minutes. So hopefully by the cat time you drop in your castle, uh, you should be pretty, uh, you know, doing pretty well. Um, should hopefully be in as your opponents uh, still advancing. But basically, um, yeah, it, it came up, it made some scouts, and then decided to tower rush. I'm not sure why he decided to tower rush quite so late on, but thankfully because I'm on stone. I've been able to get a couple of defensive towers down. Pretty uh, nicely secured uh, base, really. Now, th this whole... Uh, this was a big mess. So, he didn't manage to get his tower up. I should have been controlling the tower a little bit better, really. Uh, although, I don't think it quite... No, no, it does range the villagers. So, I don't... Yeah, I should have just been controlling the tower here. Um, but I was trying to make sure the scouts weren't killing me, so... <laughs> a little bit of quick wall in there. Ooh, look at me. I'm so pro. Um, yeah, I'm annoyed that tower went up now because I shouldn't have done. And that tower caused me a lot of issues because now I've got a garrison in there. and Yeah, it caused me quite a few issues. But anyway, as you can see, it's not going smoothly. Like it, uh, Pretty much like the step lancer build, really. It's all about surviving. I mean, the step lancer build, you can you know, cause a bit more damage. Uh, than uh, we can here but this is a 24 pop so we're not hitting castle age till should be around 13 uh, 14 25 if i've done it well but obviously i've got so much idle time here very very late uh, which does beg the question what's the point why don't you just go for a normal you know perhaps a, a, a couple of extra villages and, and really maintain that night production uh, quite well maybe even get a second one I don't know. We'll see. But it seems to be working okay at the moment. So, yeah, just trying to survive really at this point. Getting some knights out. Stupid knight popped out the wrong way. I, was, I think, I, I don't know where, uh, where my gather point is. I was up there. Of course, he went out there and got stuck. And then I didn't notice and he kept getting shot. So that wasn't helpful. At all. But he still carried on making some towers. He's trying to keep me off the gold, which is what he needed to do really um, so I've not been able to get to the gold very quickly and all this it's all just chaos my base is just chaos <laughs> um, there we go so did manage to throw some units away we finally started to get on top of things now the fact that he tower rushed has slowed him down by quite a bit uh, which is good for, uh, for me anyway and he's still got those villages on, on stone there actually which is a bit uh, pointless in my opinion, but I've got some knights out. He's trying to do one last tower Bit of a pointless exercise really and Here we go. I will take that tower out with villagers in a minute and then go on the gold um, But everything's started to calm down a bit now. I'm not sure what the uh, village numbers are like He's only got a three villager lead and I am in the castle age. I uh, don't think he's anywhere near going up at the moment No, he's not quite a way off not got enough food anywhere near enough um, but whilst uh, this is happening, as you can see, I'm just about to send these uh, stone villages down to make a castle, um, about 18 minutes. Uh, whilst this is happening, let me just tell you, if you want to stay updated with everything Age of Empires, there is a new uh, newsletter out called uh, The Town Bell. So if you go to thetownbell.com, you can uh, sign up for this little weekly newsletter that gets emailed to you. Um, and it'll just keep you up to date. Now it's delivered in um, quite a, a witty and, and comical way. Uh, it's quite an entertaining little little read. 
um, but it only takes about five minutes, so it's quite a short little read. Something to something to read when you've you know you've got five minutes. Um, and there's actually a little spot for uh, Morley Games Build Order of the Week on there. So we're doing a little bit of a collaboration at the moment, just to help each other out, promote each other's stuff. Um, so do uh, go and check out the Town Bell. Sign up for the newsletter. Um, I'll put a link in the description for it. Uh, but it's the <laughs> Morley Games uh, Build Order of the Week. It makes me think, uh, like imagine like a little game show jingle. The Morley Games Build Order of the Week. Something like that. That was nice going. Taking the long way around to come around here, I think. That's a bit weird. Lovely path in. Um, so anyway, we've come forward. We're about to drop our first castle. You can see he's got a five villager lead now. So I've, I've, I've not been really making that many villagers. Still keeping up production a little bit, but I've obviously had a, a little bit of a a little bit of a break here and there. Um, he's not got much army. He does have a few archers, uh, but nothing major. I think he's just panicking now, trying to get up as quickly as he can. Um, but yeah, he does have this castle coming down on his face. Uh, decided to go for the this spot because I thought he was still heavily taking the stone. So I thought, well, I'll knock him off the stone. It's going to take this back gold. And I, I was hoping I'd be able to range the, the, the wood, but it was a bad placement. I should have placed it around here. Um, if I wanted to, to take the wood as well, but never mind. Um, the good thing with that though, I can put those villagers on stone. So the castle's up. Um, I can now start spamming Obu from there. So you know the drill with this build. He's sending a few archers forward just to try and disrupt me a little bit. My eco is still pretty whack, really. It's not. <laughs> it's not great at all, is it? But. Um, with these, with this type of build, it's all about being aggressive. It's a bit. If you think of Huang, it's it's all about being aggressive. Eco kind of takes a, a bit of a back seat, if I'm honest. It's all about just uh, causing as much damage as you can. Now we do get arson. I'm not sure if that's come in yet. I don't think it has, because uh, those uh, walls aren't coming down quite as quickly as I'd have uh, liked. Uh, but obviously the towerish that he did, it's it's delayed him by quite a bit. Uh, in terms of getting up to the castle age, so I'm able to utilize this. But as you can see, we are collecting lots of stone. We're going to try and get another castle drop in eventually. We'll get our uh, Obu numbers up if I don't uh, lose control of them and send them to their uh, miserable pointy arrow death, which is what's happening right now. Those archers aren't really doing much. They were a bit annoying, but they didn't really achieve anything. They're going to come in my base now. Look. There we go. So, we're in on that wood line. I'm going to take those villagers out. So, his villager lead is uh, starting to dwindle. It's only going to be four villagers now, uh, which is not bad for me at all. Obviously, I had to invest quite a bit into the spearmen because I had the knights. So I was probably over invested, really. Um, sending those uh, Obu to their grizzly death again. I'll also try and protect my villagers here. There we go. They're all dead. So, Note to everybody else, try not to uh, let your, your troops die <laughs> in a stupid manner like that. But I'm going to fast forward because there's not really much more happening at this point. It's just me attacking. He does get up to Castle Age in a minute. You can see he's well on his way there. Uh, decided to kind of dive in, try, try and take a little bit of a fight. It wasn't going too well. Just wanted to thin his numbers out really because I know I'm going to be dropping a castle in a minute. So... Uh, do have enough Obu there to protect me a little bit and in comes the second castle we've got more and more Obu coming out and there uh, we can see he's starting to make some cav archers he's trying, trying to get third range uh, it does put a defensive tower down which uh, just does range my villagers but I think having the Obu there as well uh, helps quite a bit but because they're being chased, they're, um, they're not really taking enough time on uh, attacking the villagers, but this happens. My game crashed. And I was so annoyed. So I don't know whether there's some sort of game hack or if it's just a thanks DE moment. I don't know. But yeah, second castle coming down. 
uh, getting plenty of Obu. They're going to start ripping everything to shreds in a minute. And uh, their game drops. So, very, very frustrating. Uh, I think probably what I would have done with these villages is take them off. Put them on the gold so I can just keep spamming as many uh, of the Obu as I can. Um, especially with Arson, I've started getting some upgrades in as well. Uh, so we've got both armor, we've got the attack upgrade and Arson. It's only a matter of time before they start ripping everything to shreds. So, uh, yeah, this particular build could be quite good. I'm not sure I'm going to keep testing it, but when it works, it works. And it works pretty well. But that's it for this one, guys. Don't forget to check out the town bell and uh, do subscribe if you want to see more uh, 1v1s and uh, crazy build orders. See you on the next one.